and I think they suck the ink out of the E of my lip. Okay, so <laughs> right now, um, I am on my way to get my lower lip tattooed, and I'm gonna get Supreme on it because I'm kind of nervous for this. Me too. Um, um, yeah. So that's what we're doing today. Here to get a tattoo on Ethan's lower lip. It, it was so hard to convince his mom. That was a struggle. That was like the biggest struggle ever, but we did it and... We're here and I drove Ethan to come get a tattoo on his lip. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, um, I'll update y'all. <laughs> Pre-tattoo. Yeah. Put that in there for like a minute. Leave that kind of touching and then uh, just touch that exactly. You can go look at it in the mirror if you want. Okay. I think that that's perfect, but yeah, yeah always I want to make sure that you're stoked with it. This is crazy. Oh my god, I ran dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Taking care of it sucks. You wash your hands yeah. and stuff. You like grab like your car. Like you literally don't realize. Oh my god, guys, so would love. But um, with this I'm stuff, like, I'm touching people's fingers and they are fucking dark. Like, Update, guys. So I am back home right now. Um, it is like a week after. So I did it, and then I just didn't post it because I was like waiting to get home, and I had other stuff I had to post. But, so I have a story to go along with it. So it's fully healed. As you can see. But if you notice, look at the E and how it's not as strong. Well, <laughs> I am the king of bad decisions, as y'all can tell. Like, <laughs> um, <clears throat> so, well, let me just talk, let me... Okay, I'm gonna talk about what happened to the E and then I'll get into like the healing process of it. So basically, um, it was Halloween night when I got it. Wait, no, I think it was the day after Halloween. No, it was Halloween day. And I got it and the guy was like, my tattoo artist was like, hey, you're not supposed to like smoke anything. Um, you can't make out with anyone. You can't like suck anything. <laughs> anything. And I was like, <laughs> I was just like, I don't know if that's possible. Like I'm going to a Halloween party tonight. And um, I was just like, I told myself, I was like, okay, whatever. But then like, I was like, okay, well, I'll just like try my hardest, right? And then like six hours later, well, 10 hours later, I was making out with somebody. <laughs> and I think they suck the ink out of the E of my lip. <laughs> so I think they literally sucked the E out of the ink in my lip. Yeah. Um... But yeah, so honestly, like it's, like it's like not that big of a deal. Like it's still fine, but just like kind of annoying. But it's whatever. I don't really care that much. Like I was like, at first I was like, damn it, like I really like, like damn, like I really like that's out of my lip now. Like someone sucked the e out of my lip. But um, it's whatever. I'm just gonna go get it touched up whenever. Like. I have the time. Um, I don't really care that much. It like still looks the same. Like I still look good like, with it. Um, but the healing process for it was actually interesting. So the, it, um, because it's on your lip, it takes like three days to heal. And so when I was getting it done, it really did not hurt that bad at all. Like literally at all. Um, my lip, like it just did it felt like, honestly, I kind of liked the feeling. Um, it didn't hurt bad at all. It, like, there was a little bit of bleeding, like, it was whatever. It was sore for, like, it was more so it hurt the next day to, like, move my mouth sometimes. And, like, whenever I was eating, sometimes it was kind of, like, weird. But, like, it literally did not feel bad at all. Like, I honestly, like, 
the least painful tattoo I've ever experienced. Like, it's not that big of a deal. It, like, looks more painful than it actually is. But I'm also somebody who has a very high pain tolerance. Like, like nothing hurts me. Like, you can deck me in the face and I'll just be like, hi, what's up? Like, I don't know. Like, I literally, like, I don't know. I just have a super, like, high pain tolerance. And, like, it just didn't hurt that bad. Um, he told me if I was going to smoke anything that I had to put a paper towel over it, but preferably not to smoke for three days after. And meaning like jewels, like weed, cigarettes, like anything. And uh, I had a jewel, so I just literally, I, my dumb ass was walking around with paper towel like in right here, like <laughs> not caring. Um, that probably didn't help it either, but like, <laughs> see, I just like, this is just a video of me making bad decisions. But um, yeah, I don't regret it at all. I was originally gonna get 666 on my lip, but then I changed my mind because I was like, if I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do it for my Instagram. Cause like, duh, <laughs> like duh. Um, yeah, but I don't regret it at all. Like I like Libby will do this like, like he told me it takes like, it can go anywhere from literally like uh, three weeks to five years to fade. Like there's no, like some people it doesn't ever fade. Some people literally in six months it's gone. Like it just kind of depends on your metabolism. I don't know if it's metabolism or like what, just kind of like the healing process of your mouth. And, like, I'm somebody who bites the inside of my mouth all the time. Like, I'm always sitting there, like, like, biting the inside. And so, like, it's been really hard to not do that. Like, that's probably what... I don't know if that's what happened, but, like, I have just had to stop biting it. Um, but, yeah. So, I don't know about you guys, but honestly, if you want to just get a tattoo and you don't want it to be showing on your body or whatever, go get a lip tattoo. It wasn't expensive, it didn't hurt, the healing process was super easy. I was able to eat and drink immediately after, there was no wait time. I think the reason he said not to make out with anyone was A, so it doesn't pull the ink out, and B, because um, like STDs and stuff, but I um, am a crackhead, and I just don't really care. <laughs> um, and also, like, I knew the person I was making out with, and like I kind of knew they didn't have anything, so I was like, fuck it! <laughs> But, um, and then, like, you're not supposed to suck dick at all, but, like, I didn't do that, so I wasn't, like, concerned. I knew I wasn't going to do that. Um, it was funny. I literally was going to hang out with the guy the night that I got it done, and I had to cancel my plans with him because I was, like, I can't do this now. Like, I'm just going to get, like, I'm going to die. Like, <laughs> like, if I can't do... <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, I can't hang out with you tonight because I have a lip tattoo, and, like, what are we going to do? Just sit and watch TV? Like, no. Like... <laughs> I'm insane. Anyways, um, 10 out of 10 recommend it. I want to make, like, everyone I know get one. They're so much fun. Like, I just love being able to be like, yeah, what's your username? Like, hey, let's, like, let's up. Like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm insane. I'm literally insane. Okay. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to vlog this. Um, I don't really know. I just wanted to vlog this. And so here we are. Um... Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this gave you some insight as to whether or not you want to get a lip tattoo. Um, yeah, I don't really know. I'm like, hey, hey. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini vlog, mini YouTube video about my lip tattoo experience. Um, I am going to be probably getting more tattoos in the future, and I will be sure to vlog those. Um, I've, yeah, but... Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram. And as Ethan is supreme. <laughs> Ethan is supreme. Um, but yeah. Um, what's really dope about where he did it is like when I'm talking, you can't see it. As well as like you can even, you can barely see it if I do that. So he did it like the perfect area. But yeah. So alrighty. Hope you guys enjoyed. Again, be sure to subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram. My Snapchat is Trash Queen Ethan. My Twitter is Trash Queen Ethan as well. Um, I am doing a giveaway of the Shane Dawson palette. If you want to enter, all you have to do is be subscribed here and follow me on Instagram. So, uh, <coughs> all right. Goodbye, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Love you.